Hey guys, it's Brittany. In today's video, we are talking about creepy, scary, terrifying haunted dolls that are for sale. So these videos do really well on my channel. You guys always request me to talk about different haunted dolls, which I will be doing on my channel, of course. I will be making more videos about certain dolls that are kind of famous that you guys have heard of, but for this video, we're talking about dolls that are being sold on eBay, just like my other video that I did with eBay, but these are different dolls that I wanted to share with you guys and their whole like little backstory and stuff and how people are selling them on eBay. And of course, I brought my Annabelle doll with me because whenever I do doll videos, I like to have Annabelle with me. And I just want to say, because a lot of people ask me if this is the real Annabelle and no, <laughs> a lot of you guys ask me where I got my Annabelle doll. So I've answered this in a few other videos, but with my new subscribers who ask me, I always, you know, like to answer that. So I got mine on eBay and we're talking about eBay in this video, but I got mine on eBay, I think back in 2012, 2013. I forget how much I paid for the doll, but then people ask me, is it a haunted Raggedy Ann doll? And no, it is not haunted. But when I first received my doll, I had a couple minor things that happened that I kind of was like, whoa, is it really haunted? But nothing's happened since then. And that was years ago, like 2012, 2013, I believe. So wow, feels like I just got this yesterday. So I'm going to leave Annabelle sitting right over there for this video. But what do you guys think? Should that be her permanent spot? Should she always be in my videos or is it kind of too much? You know, I got Amelia, Annabelle, my Kylo Ren lightsaber. <laughs> okay, so there's a doll by the name of Tabitha. According to the seller, Tabitha moves things ever so slightly, but is otherwise a shy spirit. So that's pretty much what it says about Tabitha, so that's not too bad. At least she's a nice spirit, seems like. She's shy. There's an old haunted doll with multiple faces. It is claimed that the doll's default setting is no face, but that different faces appear to different onlookers. <laughs> Oh, it's creepy. All right, this next doll is known as Samson Wants to Play. So it says that Samson, Samson, why can't I say that, jabs ankles and causes blood vessels to burst in the seller's eye. So that's really creepy right there. There's another doll by the name of Eliza, and she's really creepy too. She kind of looks like Annabelle. <laughs> Bloody Mary just fell. I'm so sick of this. <laughs> I'm just gonna throw her over there. I'll deal with you later, Bloody Mary, but okay. <laughs> so back to Eliza. Eliza is a rag doll who frightens the owner's dog and causes general chaos around the house. What kind of chaos? I wanna know that. I wish it gave more of a description. Oh, there's a doll named Esther. Esther, that name freaks me out ever since the movie Orphan. Just, oh my god. <laughs> so it says, the owners may have cheated slightly by placing candles around Esther as if this will somehow make her evil. She doesn't look really evil. She's kind of creepy. She's wearing a white dress. She has blonde hair, blue eyes, and all these candles are just around her. What's worse is that the seller goes on to explain that Esther and her siblings died in a fire, which she accidentally started and is tormented by the sight of fire or candles as a result. All right, so those are all the dolls I'm gonna share with you guys today. Out of the list that I just told you, I would say that the old haunted doll with multiple faces and Eliza are the creepiest. And you know, I've been, you guys really want me to purchase a haunted doll online and I do want to do it. I do, but I'm nervous and you just don't know the actual story behind these dolls. Like these people selling them could have made up a story and the doll isn't haunted at all, or they're kind of sugarcoating the story behind the doll and you don't know that. And then what if you're like bringing in some demon into your house? Like you just, you don't know. So I guess my question is, have you ever purchased a haunted doll online or have you purchased a haunted doll that people claim is haunted but is not haunted and then you get it and you're just like, this isn't haunted? Let me know in the comment section below. It's, it's very, it's very interesting topic to me. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. As always, you rock my world in the song lyrics of Michael Jackson. Hashtag team Brittany 44. Hashtag my brother runs. Hey! <laughs> and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!